The IGG Bitkami has embarked on a nationwide tour where she will engage with the local people. Last year, the Office of the Inspectorate of Government launched a revised form of fighting graft, introducing a partnership with the public to take the lead. On her first leg, the IGG visited Mukono district, where she engaged with district local government leaders. Previously, it was seen as if it's government and government agencies on one side and the people on the other side. But we have gone out to um, with a new policy of engaging the people and recruiting them to own the war against corruption because the people are the victims. Then Kamiya set out and made impromptu visit to Mukono Regional Referral Hospital. Here she was guided to tour the facility. This is where we see for that mother six weeks. At first, the general picture revealed a colorful ambience with most health workers on duty. The medical superintendent, the senior doctor, was around, the surgeon is around, the nurses, the midwives. There seems to be fairly um, a, a comfortable environment. But when the IGG visited the maternity ward, some patients and caretakers accused the facility management of extorting money for services that are supposed to be free. They had finished, before they even finished the operation, they asked you the money, please bring the balance before they even release the one, the patient. Maybe let's use this amount. In defense, the medical superintendent Geoffrey Cassidy said some patients belong to the private wing where services are paid for. When you go to Kaolo, there's grade A. When you go to Mulago, there's grade A. When you go to Jinja, there is grade A. When you go to Kauro, there is grade A. So we have no crime committed when people pay. He failed to account for the no receipts issued. The IGG pledged to investigate the matter. So how are your patients? We are still waiting for them. They are, mm. they are on operation? Yeah. They are both, is it the same person or different? Different. Different. Mm. Different. Mm. Different. Mm. Different. Uganda loses at least 10 trillion shillings annually to corruption, which is equivalent to 44% of the revenue collected. Shaidat Nasaku, Dokas Kimono, UBC.